You foresee philosophers helping the physicists towards this goal. I don't, I mean, having a conversation with, I would say, and the, and I would say the physicists are also having this conversation. Yeah. So for instance, there's, a, there's a real question as to whether certain inflationary paradigms um, that are thinking about how we get to effectively classical like field modes for the different parts of, you know, gravitational field modes or, you know, matter field modes, whatever you want. But we think the initial state was a quantum one. So we need to know a story about how hmm. we get from a quantum state to, to what, looks what like. we are now. That's right. Because you're saying that if there is a model that makes sense, it started with the field. It started with kind of like what we would call nothing, but really it's <laughs> everything all at once being nothing. Yeah. And then out of that pop and then boom and then all of this. No, it's yeah. everything everywhere all at once. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you left out one of <laughs> I gave a talk on entanglement that was about that. Yeah, like yeah, had yeah. that title, but. <laughs> I watched the movie on the flight and had to cross that title out. I was like, ah, oh, it's not quite what they're doing there. <laughs> well, so but so if, the, the if, if I is, understand you correctly, yeah, 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 yeah. we went from a quantum state to a to macroscopic a classical state. Right. And yeah. there had to be a transition somewhere in there that allows us to bring these sensibilities together right. in a coherent understanding.